Which I understand, like, because if you're if you're at that skill level, grinding up to your real rank, that is such a waste of time. Like, it's such a waste of time. So if you have a if you have a strong local or battle lounge scene, like, there's no real point to be um, putting in that grind. I on the other hand, uh, am learning the game from ranked. As we get into the guile here. Be prepared for a lot of this, folks. Ooh, a jump in. No anti-air, though. That time, uh, Slice gets the anti-air. It looks like he's got the, uh, the edge in this guile fireball war. Ooh, flash kick. I love it. Good recognition on range to punish that sweep. But next, starting up this court pressure, and then the stare down into throw. There's no man was willing to just start pressing buttons right away. Oh! Not close enough to hit the punish that neutral jump. The splice takes big damage for that whiff. Into just walk up throw almost enough. The trade will close it out though. And Nick takes round one. Ooh, starting things off right with the jump. As uh, Nick gets himself in there. Oh! I That had to have been a drop flash kick here for Probably, right? I assume so. Splice spending the bar right away, not wanting it for the EX flash kicks. And then... I don't even know what's going on. All I know is Splice Helix is all over Nick. All over him. Taking a round back. Final round. Fight. Oh no! Whew. There is. It's. It still surprises me that there are some jump in spacings that just straight up beat flash kicks. Nick not having any of that jump in spacing just beats him in the air with the air throw. Then Splice doing these non ex flash kicks and they're getting stuffed. They're getting stuff. He's got to switch it over to the EX version just like that. And then booms for the V trigger activation and combo. Straight in the super. I'm not sure how I feel about that because there's a lot of scaling. I think I might have would I might have saved that for a, a kill combo. Oh man, Nick really just not any air. Whoa! It was for the jump in, but um, not enough. Oh, and then punishes straight punishes the V skill from Slice Steel with a super to close out game one. Guile win. That was smart stuff. Smart stuff from uh from Nick there. Real smart stuff. Round one. Fight. We'll go right back into that fireball war, but now it's like war of the kicks, isn't it? Throwing out Zook and knees and towards the bots at each other. Making Splice Steelix eat that boot twice in a row. Oh, good challenge in the action, but no, no uh, confirm into the flash kick off those two dads. Doing a lot, of, doing some good damage on the table there. That wasn't a good jump in space, and flash kick still able to hit it. Once again, Nick with the anti airs on point. Ooh, tries the anti-air. That one's way too far away. And then Slice gets the uh, jump in off of that V-Trigger activation, but no combo to follow up. And Nick going straight into a super. Not enough, though. Oh, jab, jab again, getting it. No combo, but gets the walk-up throw to close out the rounds. Saving that meter up. Round two. Fight. Whew. 
I'm surprised that Nick challenged the blocked boom or the blocked boom with a, a heavy punch. Cause that was plus on a blocked boom, and he was kind of far away. Like, I am so surprised that worked, but hey, what do I know? Hitting him with another dash up throw. Ooh, I'm not sure what that was. Maybe a missed jump in quick? Because Nick just tried to grab Splice jump in and just ate a super combo for it. Oh, and then probably tried probably dropped his flash kick input there as a uh, as Nick got hit out of the air. Counter hit out of the air. Splice Helix able to close out that round and tie it up 1-1. Something that I'm gonna say out loud for the uh, the people in the Discord chat. You're saying like Nick is a super silver? Come on, get your facts right. He's ultra silver. That's the line between super silver and ultra silver. That's when you know you've gone pro, right? Let's not make fun of this guy's ranked. He's made it. And he's showing that by putting on a putting on the pressure on Spice Felix. And then he's. I'm still surprised that you guys are doing a non-EX flash kicks on Waco. That doesn't make any sense to me. I mean, to be fair, I do wake up light punch DP, but that's throw invincible. It has a purpose. Oh, the raw flash kick just gets him. I, was, I am so surprised by Celix didn't go into a, a super for chip out, but... Um, but is able to get the jump in to close out the round. round two. Good tick throw. Oh, good jump in from Nick. Almost good jump in from Splice. Not quite fast enough, but ooh! Throws a, throws a boom in the face of a jumping opponent. Splice takes a full combo for that. Back in Sonic, Sonic Boom War. Ooh, probably another missed flash kick, because that was a. Oh, tries to crouch down the uh, for an anti-air, but doesn't get it. That one, the standing jab trait. Oh, great jump in! That was such a good jump in! And it's enough, and it's enough to kill. I was gonna say, I'm like, I would have expected Nick to be more prepared to be any airing because Spliced had started jumping like all the time there. But uh, no, Nick, Nick not ready for it and loses the game, um, loses the game off of that. Round one, fight. <laughs> My Steelix starting off right with some good uh, good booms and jumping, but Nick's able to recompose himself and put Nick into the or splice into the corner. But uh, wow, splice just walks his way on out. And they trade some anti air blows. Ooh! Oh. That was a weak punish. I'm actually really disappointed by that punish there, Splice. We gotten so much more. This round could have already been over. Oh, and then he messes. Then Splice messes up his flash kick. Jabs him out of the air. Did, oh no! If only he had pressed a stronger button, then Jag would have closed out the round, but no, Nick's able to clutch it out with that jump in. Getting over those V-Trigger boots. Then the Bazooka knee and here. I love it. Nick's really taking it to Splice Helix now. Telling him that he's got, uh, he's still got adjustments to make. Continuing the end here. Then, Alright, 
That flash kick's gonna close out the round. And the game is Nick. Uh, is that tied up 2 2? I'm pretty sure that's tied up 2 2. Yeah, 2 2. Going down to the last game. Synchronized Sonic Boons. Flash getting hit by the upside down kick throw bait into the frame traps. And Nick's working on that gal corner pressure, but let Splice jump his way out. And now and now uh Splice is putting on some corner pressure himself. It's a, it's a little slow, it's mostly just not letting him out, not letting him move around, but Nick using those EX boons to push his way on out and then finally jumps over. these guys have like their anti-airs are on point except for that one i guess that was a terrible anti-air never mind i don't know what i'm talking about they don't, they don't know how to anti-air at all oh no what was that Place you're killing me what kind of punish is that on a ex flash kick uh aims my heart Oh, no super. No combo in the super. Oh, messes up his flash, uh, Sonic, his charge time. <laughs> and then Nick just falls into the Sonic boom. Oh, oh, Splice is playing for that timeout scenario. Three seconds, four, two. Doesn't need it, gets the final hit. As Nick tries to push his way in. Fly Steel looks going on to set point. <laughs> Nick's feeling the pressure now. He's trying to get in, but Splice has got the answers. Except for a scoop that's already out there. Ooh, dash! Oh, crouch heavy punch for the brush counter. Now that's an answer. Stun counter is not going to be enough to kill. One more. Woo. Good blocks, good blocks. Not good enough though. Gets capped by the uh, by the low. We're going to last last game, last round. That was a that was a beating by Nick. That one I want to say he chose not to enter because it was an ambiguous space and the, uh, the flash kick might have got beaten out. That jumping works. Straight in the super spend that, not wanting that EX booms. Ooh, and then just sees his boom get eaten up by an EX boom, but uh, chooses the V skill anyways. Probably thought he would V skill up time, actually. And the uh, Nick putting on that pressure. Brandon crush crowner into the throw. Flies a little bit afraid to press. Uh, Counter throw. Ooh. Good jumping though. Beats out the crushing jab. Not as good as an anti air in, um, in season three. Nick tries to uh, to V trigger an anti air but uh, gets hit. Oh, but catches him with the upside down kick straight in the super and that closes it out. Nick taking game, game five. Moving on into uh, grand finals. Where he's gonna try and beat Chris.